A DCF caseworker is charged with battery and indecent exposure involving a woman he was supposed to be investigating. Tonight, that victim is talking only to Fox 35's. Valerie Boy is at DCF with the exclusive report tonight. Well, the single mother came to us concerned about the caseworker. She's worried other moms just like her could have been victimized. It was very, very violating, scary. DCF caseworker James Oviedo is charged with battery and indecent exposure. Ileana Torres says he asked to meet her in this public parking lot to talk about her case. According to investigators, when he got into her car, she says... He just began to try and grab my head to forcefully kiss him. Um, he, he put his hands down my pants. According to this charging affidavit, Avito forced Torres to touch him. He did expose himself, trying to forcefully put my hand on his, on his private part. Um, very scary, very, very scary. Torres says she wanted him to leave, but he wouldn't. At one point, he was like, if you give me a kiss, I'll leave your car. If you give me a kiss, I'll drop the case on your daughter. She says she did what she had to for fear of losing her child. I had to kiss him so that he can get out of my car. According to this charging affidavit, Avito showed up at Torres' home later on around midnight. Her neighbor told him to leave. It didn't make any sense to me, and at that point, I was just like, okay, I'm in danger. My kids are in danger. Like, I need to do something. That's when she called St. Cloud Police and hired attorney Mark Longwell. This seemed to be someone who was a predator, someone who was using his position of trust to prey on a single mom who's in a vulnerable position. I'm afraid for moms that might have been in the same situation that were more vulnerable. The Department of Children and Families released a statement saying DCF takes allegations of this nature very seriously. James Oviedo is no longer employed by DCF. I just want women to come forth if it did happen. In the report, Oviedo told police it was consensual but said that his behavior was unprofessional. He denies saying anything about dropping a case for a kiss. Outside DCF, I'm Valerie Boy, Fox 35 News.